Hi everyone, Scott with Dearly Departed Tours. A few years back, my friend Jeff and Troy and I took a road trip a couple of hours outside of Los Angeles to pay homage to a film. The film was called Faster Pussycat Kill Kill. It was made in 1965 and was directed by Russ Meyer, who very famously hired uh, actresses with two very important attributes to star in his movies. The road trip was a lot of fun. This movie was fantastic. I was introduced to it by John Waters, who said it was one of his favorite, one of the best movies ever made. And weirdly enough, when I was living in Chicago back in 1988, I went to see the movie in a theater called The Music Box. When I got home, there was a message on my answering machine that Divine had died that very night, which was sort of poetic, I think. Uh, eventually, I got to meet Tora Satana and Haji. I told that story back in my Frank Gorshin video about my experience with Haji and Kitten Natavidad, who was Russ Meyer's uh, last girlfriend, who was a neighbor of mine. <laughs> it was living in Hollywood was something else. Anyway, enjoy the trip back to the land of faster pussycat. Kill, kill. <laughs> Oh, you can see where Tora was staring in. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> wow. Look at the lumber used. Those are like six by eight. That's Railroad shame. ties. <laughs> and there's the stump from that tree yeah. we were looking at. Yeah. This is the Faster Pussy Cat Kill Kill house out near Lancaster. We did a road trip today out here. Right here is where Tour came screeching in in her Porsche and blasted the old man out of his wheels. Nineteen sixty six is when the movie Faster Pussycat Kill Kill came out. Russ Meyer's film starring Haji Turasatana and that blonde chick <laughs> and, and actually the window i'm in right now i'm gonna cut you up <laughs> the window i'm in right now is the exact one that tour satana was uh was watching and she's looking in with her sly eyes looking back and forth this this place is uh pretty deserted pretty desolate it's been sitting uh, uh it's in bad shape but uh here's a little tour of it this is a pretty cool road trip we took today all right, so we're outside of the uh, of the uh, of the home right now, and as you can see, it's probably I don't know what would you say when it was built twenties, and uh, look at that wood, and this is where the old man got run over right here, and there's the window that Tura was uh, peeking through, and I was just peeking through a second ago, so you can see the grating is still there, and you can see all this. This is where the uh, the table was set, the dinner table. You can see that cabinet in the movie. There's the fireplace. And this is the porch where they were all sitting. This show, this scene showed up a lot, actually. You can see. Look at that, beautiful. So that's the, uh, that was the door that they went, when she, when he went to work out and she followed him in. So that window shows up. So what I'm going to do now is go into this room. Now you can see it's pretty beaten up in here. For certain, this shows up. We saw the, there were bookshelves on, uh, or there were books on their shelves over there. And then we found out that that, you can see that behind Tura. I don't think that this other stuff was there back then. I mean, this little kitchen boothy thing. And structurally, they may have been back here, but not as these rooms. It's pretty bad. And of course, I think Vernon has made this home. I don't even know what the f*** that is. <laughs> that wasn't cool. <laughs> Wow. 
Oh, weird. I think we know where that's going to end up. Where's well, a bird's nest? We know where that is. Probably bats. All right, so let's go around. I'm gonna go back. Cause actually, if you look over the back fence, we'd be able to see a carriage. And we don't know if it's the one that shows up in the movie, but I can't believe this place is still here. Somebody had a pool back here. This is like Barker Ranch used to be. See, if you look across there, you can see like a water. Uh, see that? And also, there's a, if you look to the, just to the right of that little tree there, you can see the carriage. Let me move around to the other location. See, there's the carriage down there. So we're going to go have a look at that in a little bit. Pretty neat though, huh? Kind of Tura. So we think the fight scenes, if we think that there was a gate over there, this is obviously a new fence. We think the old gate was over here. In some of the pictures, you can actually see a telephone pole and there aren't any other telephone poles on the property. So I think the fight, and I think where uh, Thingy was stabbed was here. Thanks everybody for watching. I appreciate it. If you would give this video a thumbs up or a thumbs down, please subscribe and hit the little bell if you want to be notified of when my videos get uploaded next. I really appreciate you following me. I appreciate Jeff for going along with Troy and I on this trip. We had a great time. I thank my friend Donna who always makes really interesting things happen. This video is especially dedicated to Ann Meyer and Jolene Cladoris for your amazing support there's a patreon link below there is a paypal link below you guys are the best thank you until next time